Hey guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create flip cut transition effect in Fimura 10. And actually, you can do the same in Fimura 9 also. Alright, so let me show you the transition. It's nice, right? So let's go to my computer. I will show you about this. So here I am uh, on my screen and this is Fimura 10 and uh, this is the, the example project. Let's open it. Okay, so this is my example timeline. As you can see here, we have some transition here. So this is the first one. Uh, with this transition, I use two, two different kind of transition. One is the uh, flip to the left and the other is flip to the right. And at this at this position, I, I use another one, uh, flip up and flip down. So in order to create this this kind of transition effect, you have to to select a pair of transition. I mean two two transition that have uh, opposite effect. For example, the uh, one uh, flip to the left, and you need to select the other flip to the right. Okay, and that is a theory. And I will show you how to do this uh, step by step. Uh, and here I have my 4k video so maybe it uh, will be a little bit lucky and down here we have a sound effect and uh, this is a, a pattern sound effect uh, you have inside Fimura 10 uh, go to the audio and add the sound effect here you can find it uh, it's already inside your software when you install the program and it, this is the background music that I normally use uh, on my video okay and at the end is the intro so this intro i will not show you how to create this intro okay uh, so uh, this is the uh, one kind of transition and this is another kind uh, because the method to create uh, this transition are slight slightly uh, different okay uh, let's delete everything on the timeline first okay and now we need to uh, get my footage here i'm going to do this one a 4k video okay and I keep the project setting I'm going to split it at this position and delete the rest and I'm going to put another video here and then I'm going to split it also uh, all right so yeah uh, I have to clip on the timeline now so let's uh, press this button to view everything on the timeline so this is the, the clip without transition effect okay So the first thing I want to do is to add the transition. To add transition in Fimura 10, it is very easy. Uh, go to the transition. To create this uh, this kind of uh, flip cut transition, you need to go to here, speed blur, and then select the simple simple one. You have 20 different transition here at this folder, and there's a different thing here. For example, we can use this one, flip row number three, with flip row number two, a pair of transition effect. And uh, this one, flip row number four with the simple row number five. Or it's up to you, okay? So for this example, I'm going to use this one, uh, this couple. Okay, the first one, let's drag and drop it uh, right here. And the second one, we need to change the duration of the transition. Uh, just double click on the transition here. And remember, do you want to change it to one second or two seconds? It's up to you if you want to, to have faster transition. You can change it to two seconds and then uh, you can click ok uh, the next thing i want to do is to split the clip uh, make sure that you split only one second uh, half one second on uh, on both sides okay so this side is half second uh, i want to to add the transition first so i have a uh, something here that i can uh, easily see the the position that i want to cut here just cut it and you can move it to this position at the end of the transition and also select the clip and then split all right so the next thing we can just highlight both of them both of the split uh, part here and then uh, you can press ctrl c to copy uh, copies copy them and the next thing you need to lock this track and then move your playhead to this position at the beginning of the uh, this part and then press ctrl v to paste it you know, on the top track all right and by doing this, we have two, two clips uh, on top track and 
uh, we is the, we are the same the same with the the clips at the bottom okay so the next the next thing we can change the change the uh, the transition here uh, we we have just used a flip row number three and now we can use flip row number two on top track okay just drag and drop it down here all right so this is a, the the first one the first transition it flipped to the um to the left uh, to the right and the uh, the top one it flipped to the the left and final thing we want to do here is to add a crop uh crop area to this clip and this clip on the top track to do that uh, we need to go to effect here and then uh find the utility uh, you have the utility folder here uh, or you can just search it if you put the, the mouse in the included folder by the way this is a crop effect you just need to drag and drop it directly at the at, at the clip on the top track okay just uh, drag it and drop it directly to here okay and uh, let's drag and drop uh, this crop effect to the second one all right so we uh, we just finished uh, adding uh, crop effect to this clip and now we need to adjust the crop area so uh, because the the transition is uh, flip right, left and right so we uh, we are going to adjust the top and bottom top and bottom uh, at the crop effect okay to do that we just uh, double click on on the the clip here and then go to video and then find the video effect here uh, down here and then you click on this button and you see some uh, some parameter to adjust the crop area we have left and right and now top and bot bottom and to create the effect i'm going to put it uh, right here at the, at the top uh, 30 uh, at the bottom is 30 also the same okay uh, for this clip and uh, i would do the same for this clip so i can just uh, right click at the first clip and then copy effect and then i can paste it to the second uh to the second clip here and that's that's done so we have just finished the first transition effect in femora 10 flip cut and let's render the timeline so that uh you can see it better all right and here is the final result of the first transition effect Uh, that's nice right and of course you need to uh, to add the sound effect here down here at the uh, pattern sound effect or stuff like that so to make it better okay all right so give me one second to ask you to do something if you think that this tutorial is helpful don't forget to like and comment on this video that will help my video grow and also help my channel and if you are new here consider to subscribe to my channel i make tutorial about filmora and all, all about software okay and thank you and let's continue the tutorial okay so now i'm going to show you the second method to create this flip cut transition effect and it, it is exactly the same step uh, you do with the first one uh, the only difference is is that you replace the crop effect uh, with an image mask effect okay let me show you how to to do that uh, for example here uh, we can change the uh, the the transition effect also uh, we go to transition here and then add a split uh, speed blur simple and then uh, now we are going to uh, to add another another one this this one uh, simple row number nine uh, to the bottom and simple row no number eight to the top and also we need to add an image mask right and uh, to go to video effect and add the same folder uh, add the same utility folder here uh, we have the image mask uh, just drag and drop it directly to the first clip on top track and to the second one here um, and now i'm going to disable disable the crop effect in this uh, video okay so the, for the first one just double click on the on the clip and then go to video effect here and then i'm going to just uh, disable the, the crop effect here and now we need to change the image mask also and we will, we will do the same for the second clip uh, for the image mask i'm going to uh, scroll down a little bit here so just again i need to click on the uh, the clip again so here we have an image mask and now we need to change to different shape here uh, there's many image uh, masks here by the way for this effect we are going to select uh, okay uh, this one and uh, this one is okay because uh, we have the uh, flip 
up and flip down so we need to uh, to crop on, on the right side and on the left side and we are going to do this one uh, this this image match and now we can change the, the width of the mesh so now we can change it to 50 or stuff like that okay and then we can click OK so this is for the first one and now you just uh, all you need to do is just uh, right click on the first clip and then copy the effect and then you can select the second clip and paste the effect it's, uh, it's easy it's just the same okay so let's double check with them the effect in the second clip uh, okay so it's to have crop and uh, we can disable crop here and the image mask uh, so the effect will look like this so now I'm going to render the timeline and show you the result a few moments later all right so this is the final result for the second transition effect uh, let's play it that is nice right so that is technically how you can uh, create flip cut changes and effect in Filmora 10 and uh, here at this position maybe you want to extend the, the duration of the transition maybe two seconds or stuff like that uh, it will slow down the transition and uh, but it's up to you okay so i hope this video is helpful for you if you have any questions just let me know in the comment section below thank you very much for watching and i will see you in my next video bye bye